Hey guys, it's your one and only Waka Waka Doctor. If you're a fan of mystical arts, magic, and everything fairy tale, this is where you want to be. Once again, I'm out there showing you the best of travel through my eyes. Today, it's Cappadocia! It's hot hair balloon time. Look at that. I'll see you guys up there. You have to really, really do this. When you find yourself in Cappadocia, this is definitely worth the experience. Look at that. Well, that's Waka Waka Doctor back on the ground. This right now is my view, right? This is where I am staying. And Cappadocia is known for cave houses, Valley of the Kings, hot air balloon and the likes. And this is where I'm staying in a cave. So first of all, the region of Cappadocia, here is a volcanic area. And in this area, we have four dormant volcanoes. Today, these volcanoes, they are not active. But actually, as you know, there is no guarantee. Okay? <laughs> we hope not today, okay? Yeah. So one of them, the closest one, it is just 70 kilometers away from here. We call it the Mount Ergs. It's in the city of Kayseri, where is the airport, maybe oh, okay. uh, yeah. on your left side, maybe you saw it, you know, we call it the Mount RGS, 3,900 meters high, it's the fifth highest mountain of Turkey. And also on the southern part of Cappadocia, we have two more, we call them Hassan and Melendis mountains, 3,000 meters. And also on the north, there is one more, we call it Gülüda, 2,200 meters high. This is the first place I will be showing you um, in the city of Cappadocia. Now remember that Cappadocia, in my introduction, I told you is a mystical city, city of magic. Because if you look at the map of Turkey, you actually would never find a place labeled Cappadocia. Cappadocia means the land of hearses uh, in the Persian times. And so this place is called the Mushroom Valley. And so I'll be showing you bits and pieces of the Mushroom Valley. But take a look, volcanoes that have been active for many, many years. 25 million years BC. Look. This is the Mushroom Valley. I'll show you other things in there. Now take a look at this. This is a three-story mushroom. And I'm going to show you what it looks like. Valley, mushroom valley. 
Wow! People used to climb this, look! <laughs> I'm gonna try to get to the top. Wow, it's all, it's all, no, no, no. This is impossible. But, you know, um, thousands of years ago, you used to do it to get to the top. But I can't do that. Sorry, I can't. Unfortunately, I can't. But this is it. So, Valley of the Kings. There you go. All right, guys, this is the second thing you should see in Cappadocia. It's called the Red Sea or the Red River. Sorry, it's called the Red River. It's the longest river uh, in Turkey, actually. It's 1,360 kilometers long and it connects the eastern part of Turkey up until the red uh the black sea yeah connects both of them and if you see i'm just on the bridge look i'm on the bridge um and it connects the see there's an old town just after the river and i'm going to the old town now to experience some pottery next point of call is the kea sultans which is the home of pottery so i'm gonna go do a yeah, bit yeah, of go pottery <laughs> disco, this is disco. my tour guide he's been the one showing me all about cappadocia and now he's gonna teach me some pottery okay thank you it's pottery time The cover. <laughs> wow. Uh, this is magic now. Time to try my hands on some pottery. <laughs> and I have my teacher here.
Can I make a cup? How can I make a cup? Only press me, but slowly, not too much press. Slow, slow. Can I sit right? Oh no. No, no. Esge. I get it now. Esge. Good. Sona. Sona, Sona. Get it, Amma. Get it. Waka waka. Bowl of pepper soup. This is the next place you have to see if you're in Cappadocia. It's called Imagination Valley. Now it's called Imagination Valley because these rocks form different things depending on what you can see. So I'll start with this one. Can you see? It looks like a camel, right? Okay, I'll take you to another one I can see. Um, let me see. Yep, look, looks like fingers, right? I'll show you one more interesting one. Look, this looks like a keyhole. This one looks like two dogs kissing, Romeo and Juliet of Cappadocia. Uh, you see this in the middle, uh, just before the two dogs, looks like the art of Napoleon. And you can also see two men riding on a camel. Can you see? <laughs> so this is Imagination Valley, and it's definitely a place you need to see when you visit Cappadocia place for you to see is this monastery in Cappadocia look at that you know um, all the stories in the Bible with St. Peter and St. Paul traversing the whole of Europe you know um, from the Middle East to Europe was through Cappadocia and this monastery was established by St. George and two of his friends just to expand Christianity and they will gather here and learn more about Christianity. So this is one more thing you need to see when you're in Cappadocia. I'll take you in there. Uh, another thing you should see if I'm able to show you is the underground city in Cappadocia. There's actually a huge city on the ground. But let's not talk about that. Let's focus on this monastery. So, just look at that. <laughs> and as you see, like the other caves, also people carry them out these caves by hands with the chisels. This is the underground city I'll take you down the pigeon hole <laughs> so you'd see it's like a city it's actually not like a city it's a city on its own look it's so dark in here I can't show you but you know people lived here Worked here, survived in here many, many years ago. So many interwoven. Hey guys, we're out here. Yeah. 
This is a Rolling Stone that covers the door. Still on the ground. Here you go. The door shuts this way. Uh. All right, guys. I'll see you again later. Friends, that has been Cappadocia. Some people say it's Cappadocia, but can you get it? Cappadocia in Turkey. Now, don't forget to subscribe, like, um, and give me feedback on my channel. But if you love to have fun, you should travel to Cappadocia in Turkey, where you get the most amazing experience. You've seen all I've shown you, the hot air balloon, the scenery, the sunrise was fantastic. Um, the ATV ride and the various things you can see uh, during the tour, which I showed you in the video. Uh, from me, this is your one and only Waka Waka Doctor.